Hi, all. Um, so yeah, I'm Fraser, CEO of Checked, where we're building trusted data economies. But what is that? And firstly, kind of what we'll talk through in the next three and a half minutes is how you shouldn't be the kind of the victim or the product in surveillance capitalism and how we're going to shift that narrative and paradigm. Um, and this is how it's kind of broken. We're all Oliver going to companies and asking for our data back, even though it's ours, and begging for it every single time. Um, and then it creates data silos. And pretty much everyone in this room will have been victim of a breach, some people actually very, very recently. And ultimately, like that status quo might be acceptable if it was usable, if the user experiences were incredible. And what we've got instead is people with like, uh, at least 100 passwords on average. And the reality for me is probably somewhere north of 500, just based on like a sample that I did. And the reality is like it's getting bigger and bigger every single time. And we're trying to manage that through things like password managers, just as a stopgap. And we think instead, we believe you should be the center of your data universe. Like you should actually own that data and have control of it and be really at the center of this. It's got various names, whether that's self-sovereign ID or SSI, decentralized ID, or even now Web5. And our partners think so too. So we've only been there around a year, but have like around 100 partners all helping us in this direction. And this is what it really looks like. Like you should be able to take your data wherever you want and be rewarded for doing so, whether that's like taking avatars through games, taking reputation where you socialize, your medical history where you need care, all of that data should be available to you wherever you need it. And what, what we're specifically providing are the payment rails for this data. So the ability to release that data to individuals while still providing a commercial model for organizations so that they can make their revenues as they do currently. And so, and one of the ways we're driving this through is by building out kind of interoperability so we're leading the space by building support for as many different data formats as possible with the theory that by making this data more portable, we make it more valuable and hence we increase the adoption through companies and actually get these use cases into your hands. So this is just something we're able to announce today in terms of on the product side. And the final kind of thing to say in the few seconds is like we're now onboarding partners, their clients and their use cases. So if you see yourself as part of any of those cohorts, come and find us afterwards. It's been a pleasure. Bye.